In this tutorial, we'll discuss the PyAuto GUI library in Python and how we can make use of a small fail-safe option that was built into it by the developers. It's a bit of a security feature in case your program goes out of control because in PyAuto GUI, you're basically giving control of your mouse and keyboard over to the program. So what if it ends up shutting down your system? What if it ends up deleting an important file or something? And there's a whole list of problems that can occur if you're not careful. Maybe you made a mistake somewhere and you don't realize it and only when you run the program and it's about to delete something or click on something it's not supposed to and you're like, oh no, how do I stop it? And it's not possible normally, right? But there's actually a fail-safe option that was built into PyAuto GUI that you can use and prevent the execution from proceeding. Okay, you can stop the execution midway. And this is a little script I wrote here for, for one of my previous videos. And I'm gonna show you how I can prevent it from uh, executing halfway through, okay? So what I'll do is simply run this using uh, Control Alt N, that's a keyboard shortcut. And it's gonna move over, copy this, come down there and print it out. Sorry, paste it. That's what this program does. What it does is copies this code over here and goes down here and pastes it. I'm gonna show you now how I can break the execution midway. Let me just increase the duration on this to two just so we can see it happen more properly. Okay, so I'm gonna run this code and now it's executing. Now what I'll do is before it gets a chance to paste it, I'll run over and move my mouse over to the corner of the screen like I just did. Okay, you can see that this fail safe exception was raised and the text was not pasted down here. This is a fail safe, okay, as I mentioned. And if you move your mouse to any corner of the screen, okay, if you dra immediately drag it over, not, sorry, not drag, just move it normally, move it over to the corner of the screen and this exception will be raised. Okay, see, you can, you can see it written here, fail safe triggered from moving mouse to corner of the screen. Okay, so yeah, pretty cool. So this is something that you can you know, use and there's actually a way to disable this. It's not recommended to disable it as you can see over here, but let me just tell you guys just in case. Okay, maybe you believe that your program is good enough that you know, you've checked its errors enough, you've gone through it, you've tested it for all possibilities, maybe. But even still, I wouldn't recommend it, but let me just tell you guys anyway how we can do this. PyAutoGUI.failsafe is equal to false. All right, this disables it. And uh, hold on, let me remove that. So yeah, if I run this code now, and if I try to disable it, it's not gonna work. Okay, I'm moving it to the corner, but it's still executing. See? So yeah, this is how you can use the failsafe in PyAuto GUI, and how you can disable it if you want to. Maybe your users are, are gonna abuse it or something. I don't know, that's up to you and the situation you're in. So yeah, I've taught you about this. Do with it what you will. And yeah, do, do subscribe to the channel because we have a lot more content on uh, PyAuto GUI and other cool Python libraries like it. So yeah, it's definitely gonna be informative for you guys if you stay notified with all the future videos. So yeah, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what you thought and I'll see you guys in a later video.